Hi! In today's video, we're going to be looking at a flip through of the Lollipop Logic book. This is a really good book for early critical thinking skills. It says that it's for grades K through 2 and that this is book 1. It features activities using analogies, pattern decoding, inference, and more, and it has easy to use reproducible activities, and it appeals to pre-readers and early readers. So this is called Lollipop Logic, and at the beginning, it tells you about the book and how you might want to introduce each of these skills. And so it tells you that in these sections, you will definitely want to introduce certain subjects before you would go on. So you wouldn't want to just jump into problem decoding. You would want to start with relationships and work your way through. And then it has, this is the teacher's instructions where it tells you how exactly to do the lessons and the sequences. I'm just going to move that up through there. So each lesson has a small portion of information that it tells you about. Once you get it started and you have an idea of how it is done, it's pretty easy to just give to the students and tell them exactly how to use this. We did use it a little bit at the beginning of the year, but we've really started using it more um, through the summer. And so you would just look at these for sequences and you're going to put in what happened first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth. And so these are all for the sequences. More sequences. And then we move on to relationships. And then how is, you know, the triangle related to one of these items? Same thing here. We've got how are these items related to the items in the box. Mm -hmm. Then it moves on to analogies. And so this is just a very easy sit down, do a page, and it just kind of gets that critical thinking portion of our brain working. Then it goes into deduction. This part you would probably need to, you know, help your reader read more than likely, especially if they're in the kindergarten and in first grade, you would need to read these and help with the clues. More deduction. Then we've got some pattern decoding towards the end. And then we go with the inference. So again, this is just a nice little book to get the critical thinking going. At the very end, you have the answers. So if you're not quite sure what one might be, you can go and it shows you the lesson and the answers for each one. And then on the very back, it kind of goes along with the Common Core Standards Alignment Sheet and how that relates. And so if you're looking to pick this up, this is book one. After we finish this, I will be buying book two for it because it is just a really good logic book and super quick to just pull out and use um, when you have a few minutes. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thanks for watching.